This time we're gonna learn how to use a graduated cylinder to find the volume of an irregular solid. So the first step is to fill this graduated cylinder with some water. Now when I say some water, it doesn't really matter how much you put in as long as whatever object you're going to try to uh, submerge goes all the way under the level of your initial water. So for me, I'm going to start with quite a bit. That's a little too much. And that's not enough. There, perfect. All right. Now, if you'll notice, I need to start by reading how much I have in there to begin with. To do that, I can't do it from up here. If I do it from up here, I'm not gonna get the proper reading. I have to come down and be exactly level with the level of the water. Okay, if you notice, I'm right at 75 milliliters of water. Now, I write that down because that's my beginning volume of water. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna place my object in the water. The water level should go up and then I subtract the two numbers to get the volume of the object that the water was displaced by. So let's take a look over here. We've got, once again, our good friend, Mr. Bacon. Come on, Mr. Bacon, let's go on in there and see if we we'll see what we can do. Uh-oh, Mr. Bacon, you don't fit in this graduated cylinder. Well, you know what? We're gonna choose something else then to do this today's example. I've got a staple remover that's long and skinny. Should fit in there just fine. Place it in. And remember, when placing objects in a graduated cylinder, you should always lean the graduated cylinder and let it slide in. You should never drop it all the way in. You could break the cylinder. All right, now we take a look at the level of the water. We gotta get down and look. Our level is now 85 milliliters. So I write down 85. My initial volume was 75, which means that the staple remover is 10 milliliters. That's the volume. To get it out, to get it out, I just go back to my where I got my water from, pour it out gently, and, and get my item out. Thanks, Mr. Bacon, for helping us out with this again today.